Hey, welcome back to Survival Preparedness for Beginners and welcome to Spicy Video. All right, now when you're doing your preps and everything else, especially right now before all the prices really start going up because it's only a matter of time before Walmart is gonna have to start raising all their prices. They just can't keep giving this stuff away, basically. All right, and what I'm talking about is spices, folks. All right, you know how they have those great big huge bins and they're right there, usually over by the meat market or somewhere in that area and they just have these bins full of all these spices for 98 cents. Make sure you're stocking up on these spices. Now, what can you do with these spices? All right, now, the question is, why do you need spices? Before we get to what can you do with them? Why do you need spices? Well, just because it's an emergency situation, a grid down situation, an SHTF situation, doesn't mean that you can't enjoy a little bit of flavor in whatever food you may be cooking. That raccoon may taste a lot better with spices than all by itself, if you get what I'm saying. All right, folks? So you want to make sure that you are stocking up and having spices. All right, all kinds of spices. Whatever kind of spice you like, Make sure that you have it. If you like curry, buy curry. If you like Italian seasoning, buy Italian seasoning. You like barbecue, you like chili, you like, you know, you need the onion and the garlic and all those type of things, salt and pepper and everything else. And then what do you do with it? You do what I did. You buy the small Mylar bags. Okay, I got them all in a Ziploc bag just because they're easier to store this way, folks, because they're so, well, this is the size of them, all right? You see how little these things are? Here, let me give you a little idea. All right, these are little, little dinky packs. All right, now I've got every spice known to man in here. All right, this thing is full of all kinds of spices. You got a Southwestern spice. You got a whole allspice. You've got um, uh, anison seed. You've got... Uh, pumpkin pie spice. You never know. You might get hungry want some pumpkin pie. You know, there's sage right here. There's sage. There's thyme. Adobo. All right. Ground ginger. And the list goes on and on. See what you can do with this? Spices in your life in an SHTF situation. What you talking about? You just have to make sure that you have the spices so that you can enjoy your food, whatever you may be eating, that raccoon will taste so much better if you're not prepared. Get it? So I'm Survival Preparedness for Beginners. Today was making sure that you have spices in your life and not your loved one. Spices that you can eat and enjoy and make things so much better. So until next time, folks, you all keep prepping. You all stay safe and remember, Spice up your life a little bit. Can't hurt. And I'll catch you all on the flip side.